What's going on everybody? I'm making another video on today is about proportioners. Um, you may see these on other people's rigs or other videos. Um, here to just run down what they basically do. Do you really need one? Um, and yeah, how much it costs as well. So this one I bought off a website. I think it was called Cigar Softwatch or something. I'll put the link in the description, but they are pretty spendy. They're around $280. So um people will like to think as them as an investment since you can sell them later but anyways short story of what they do is proportion out um how much chemical you need and how much soap you need it all kind of mixes it into one uh one thing which goes to your soft soft wash system um so let me just start on the right side here so the right side this I got hooked up for strictly my chemical tank. So this tank right here is just for soft wash, or sorry, not soft wash, just uh, chemical, which is sodium hypochlorite. SH is what other people call it. So I made a drop stick right here. Um, yeah, you can actually just take a look at that drop stick quick because if you want a video on how to make a drop stick, I can do that as well. Um, but yeah, so that basically feeds to my proportioner. Super simple, I just use a 5 8 um, Flexilla. Um, the middle one is my soaps or your surfactant, um, which is in this tank right here. It's like an eight gallon tank, I think. Um, so that is straight surfactant, uh, which goes to a fourth, I think, line. I, this That's what this is, uh, one fourth of line. And then that feeds to the middle one. Um, and then the other one is just for water. So this goes to my big tank right here, which is also on a drop stick. Um, so yeah, that's what the three components are, which all feed to one. Uh, these little knobs here is what you can control, control it with. So whenever I'm doing a job, um, I made a video on proportions as well. So you can kind of, um, correlate that to this as well um but yeah so basically say i am doing uh concrete work um on concrete work with my surface cleaner right there so what i will do is turn my water this switch goes right here turn my water all the way on um and i like to do concrete at about a four percent so four percent um, which would be probably around, see, where are we at? It'd probably be at a, let me think here. Yeah, two. Um, so that's basically, you can do two and a half actually. So that's kind of half, half, um, half water, half, uh, SH. Um, then for your, um, soap, I just like to turn it on maybe just to one, um, you don't really need that much for soap. It just helps kill away the smell, um, of the surfactant or sorry, not the surfactant, the SH. Um, so yeah, concrete, since I have a 10% sodium hypochlorite, you kind of want a little less than half. So yeah, two would be good for concrete and then housing. I usually put on one. Um, so what this really does is just save you a lot of time and saves you, to batch mix so you don't have to batch mix you don't have to empty your tank and put in a whole another batch you can just come over here and say you just finished up a house wash turn this up and you want to do some concrete work in their side or their driveway and it'll it'll go strictly to um strictly to that other mix so which is really nice you don't have to empty or do any other batch mixing stuff so highly recommend one um, they are an investment. You can always sell them. You can always make your own as well, but I just found this one online that's already pre-made and it's fairly cheap. They are kind of expensive, which is surprising, but, um, but yeah, you will definitely need one of these in your future. If you are very, um, going forward with this pressure washing business. So that's what it is. I'll link in the description. If you have any other questions about it, just let me know. And yeah, I'll catch you guys later.